Ooh, let's go. I was able to get a seat. What do I have to read? Knowledge. Knowledge. I don't know if this... This either probably gives charm or it's just a uh, location thing. This is proficiency. Let's do Medjed Menace. Hmm? Good or evil, the threat of Medjed can be felt all over the world. What are your thoughts? There's danger afoot in the internet world too, it seems. So oh, you're telling me, brother. Hey, hey. Oh, I didn't realize how long you've been reading, so how far did you get? Head shake. It's my favorite distance in books. Do you ever use the study corner in the library? I always end up goofing off at home and not many people know of it. But isn't the environment kind of a problem? Have you heard the rumors about that transfer student? Ah, uh, him. Yeah, he used to be all anyone ever talked about. But you remember Mr. Kamashita's big apology? The transfer student's kind of old news now. My recent test scores haven't been so hot. If I don't shape up, my allowance could be in danger. I probably asked chat this kind of question many times, but did anyone in chat ever have an allowance Today we're growing up? Over. I definitely did not have an allowance growing up. Like, you hear about allowances so much in, like, media and stuff, but I feel like they don't... They, I feel like they hardly exist in actual reality. I cannot remember a time I talked to someone who was like, yeah, I had an allowance. Just food money, really? That's not an allowance. That's like, hey, don't starve to death, child of mine. <laughs> Oh, two people in chat apparently had allowances. So, like, when I say allowance, I don't mean, like, I asked my parents for money and they gave me money once. I mean, like, once a week or once a month. Like, was there a normal time period where you would be given money by your parents, like, once a week or once a month? Because that's what an allowance is to me. Asking your parents to buy you something or asking for money for something or other, that's not an allowance. That's just your parents being like, yeah, you can have some money because you're my child and I care about you. All right, there are a couple of people in chat who had allowances growing up, apparently. That's wild. No one in my area that I knew of got allowances. It was like, it was not a thing. It's possible to apply math even to an abstract concept like beauty. God, I hate math. The golden ratio used in the Mona Lisa and the Parthenon is a famous example. But a different ratio has been used in Japanese art and architecture since ancient times. I'm sure you've all heard of the silver ratio. Now then, Kurusu-san, take a look at this. I vaguely remember this question. Give me an answer. The golden ratio is 1 to 1.618, but do you know the silver ratio? Oh, I don't remember this exact number. Someone in chat tell me the answer. I have literally no idea. I remember talking about the golden ratio. I remember, like, the golden and silver ratio being a thing from playing Persona. But uh, I do not remember the exact numbers for it. All I could do here is give a guess. And that's about it. Oh my goodness, a yawn out of nowhere. It has to be, judging from these two pictures, the silver ratio has to be less, right? So it's not 1.7. It's probably 0.3 or 0.4. Chat says it's 0.4. This is it. Precisely. That's correct. You can see it's closer to a square than the golden ratio, right? One theory says it's because Asians have rounder faces than Westerners, so they prefer a similar shape. This ratio was used in things like ukiyo-e paintings and the pagodas at Horiyuji Temple. One you should all be familiar with is B4 size paper. Those proportions are the silver ratio. I've done it yet again. Nice going. I'm a genius. One day, we'll get knowledge to level three. Oh yeah, I hear that mascots that are seen as cute have faces that are close to this ratio. In other words, if you use this ratio, you can make cute things. It is true that mascots tend to have roundish faces. Yeah, it's a shame that you're ugly. Why are you looking at me like that? Just wondering how the ratio failed. Well, then. Lady On and I will head over to Madarame's house. Here we go. On, Morgana, we're counting on you. Me and him are banned from going there, so all we can do is wait here. No, you two have something different you'll need to do. What do you mean? You have to wait inside the palace. Once that door opens, sneak in and look for some kind of control room. We need to make sure the door can't close anymore after it's open. Oh, I get it. Okay, you can leave that to us. 
to think you'd really come. I assumed you were lying when you contacted me. This is probably one of the funniest moments in the game. <laughs> I love this bit. I'm sorry it was so sudden. Oh, it's not a problem. But, as I told you yesterday, Sensei will be returning in about 20 or 30 minutes. So, um, I'm sorry if that causes some anxiety on your part. That's why I'm here today, damn it. What was that? Oh, no! <laughs> it was nothing! By the way... Have you gained some weight? You think so? I weigh the same as always. Maybe I'm bloated today. So then, can you, um, get ready here? So many of these clothes are, like, ruined beyond belief now. I need to take my clothes off, right? Yes, please. I'm embarrassed. Uh, could you look the other way? Oh. That was tight. Tight? No. I'm doing this for art. Don't look over here, okay? Hey, your sensei is coming back soon, right? I believe so. Hmm. Do you think we could do this somewhere else then? A little more atmosphere would be lovely. Well, this should be good enough. But wouldn't a room with a lock be a bit better? A lock? <laughs> Must a girl say more? But the only one with a lock is Sensei's room. Then why not there? I can't intrude. Besides, I don't have the key. <sighs> he says he doesn't have the key. It's okay. That's why I'm here. I'll just use this hairpin. Takamaki-san, are you about... You were wearing all this? Uh, don't you think it's cold today? <laughs> I suppose so. The sun is starting to set. Right? That's why a change of location would be nice. I mean, I'm gonna take it all off. <laughs> True. It might make for a better picture if I can brighten my model's mood. Uh-huh. That's right. She may even be willing to try out various expressive poses for use in a dynamic composition. W what kind of poses? Lady on, you have to act. Get back in character. <clears throat> Let's go. I was just starting to get in the mood. On's acting, as always, phenomenal. Wait, if you wander around, Sensei will... Oh, it's so hot. We really can't use any other room. Hey, why not this one? Please wait! I'm counting on you, Mona. Are they seriously gonna be able to pull this off? She was saying stuff like, I'll just seduce him with my acting, but that sounds out of her league. Plus, we ain't got one sign this place is gonna open. Isn't Matarame coming home soon? On top of that, even if Mona's able to unlock the door, how's he gonna show it to Matarame? And then even if they do show it open, any normal person would just close it right up again. Doesn't that mean we only got a few seconds to get in? Better be quick. To be blunt, won't it be a miracle if this works? This is an anime. We're all about miracles. It'll definitely work. I want to think that too, but... It's almost time. Please, uh, can you just wait and... On was wearing jean shorts underneath her skirt and leggings and all? I feel like that would be... I mean, 
surely like wearing the all of the outfits on top of each other was uncomfortable in general, but I feel like jean shorts underneath the skirt and leggings would be the worst, but what do I know? What's past here? That's So the door Mona mentioned is up ahead. I keep telling you, you can't. You're still not done? It's hard to do this with cat paws. Uh, is something the matter? Oh, um, so, what is this room? It's a storage area for old paintings. Storage? Hey, Kitagawa-kun, why don't we do it in here? I won't be embarrassed if we go somewhere nobody can find us. Only Sensei can go in there. Please! I want to be alone with you. Somewhere, like, quiet. <laughs> you know, where we won't get interrupted. Is he really going to buy that terrible act? Stay focused! Hmm? It's just so frustrating that my feelings aren't getting through to you. Hitagawa-kun, do you not like girls like me? No, th that's not true. How is that working on him? Thankfully, like all phantom thieves, he's a little stupid. Please, we can continue this inside. Sh sure. I mean, no, we can't go in there. Uh, it's locked anyway, so... Fine. This is too embarrassing. I'm leaving. But... Let's just do it in here, okay? What do I do? I'm home. S sensei Yusuke? All right, it's open. Huh? What are you doing there? It's... it's not what it looks like! Huh? Not in there! Ah, uh, nothing's happening. I wonder what's... Hmm? It's off! Seriously did it! Let's get in there, brother. Stay on guard. Oh, right. These could come back on at any second. Let's go. Hacker voice, we're in. Oh, I thought I could read this. All right. Okay, let's find the control room quick. The pass gonna close up if we screw around for too long. But it's just gonna be me and you for a bit if we run into any enemies. You good? Let's kick some tail, brother. Yeah. I'll be counting on ya. Oh, there's a lad right there. Just a second, there we go. Uh, you know, honestly, actually, maybe I should hey. go back and, uh... Oh, dang it. I should have gone to the safe room and saved first. I can feel it. I can feel it, too. This new, I think, is the mini boss we're about to fight one shotting me. <laughs> Man, already? Hey, what do you want to do? Let's come back later. And again. Wish we could, but we don't got time, and I'm not gonna let their hard work go to waste. We just gotta go for it. The real problem is the fact that we gotta handle this with just the two of us. Anyways, I'll leave the timing up to you, dude. Uh... Sorry. Yo, you're gonna let us through right now? Huh? Who are you? I see that attire. You must be the thieves who dare threaten Lord Madarame. Hi. What about the will seed? Security system? We'll go back for the will seed. We can go back. Told you to save? No, you didn't. I'm looking at chat right now. No one has said to save before I walked in there. You cannot go any further. You are trespassing on Lord Madarame's territory. You guys ain't got nothing on us. 
I'm more scared of screwing up and having on yell at me. I feel that, brother. Right. Definitely hope for some dodges. I met before you left last time. I don't care about saving all the way back then. That was ages ago. Persona! Get some forgetfulness. Okay, I did a lot of damage. A lot of damage. We're gonna have to use healing items. Definitely. That didn't do very much damage to us, thankfully. That Skullcracker. Nice dodge. Beautiful. You love to see it. Get hit again, idiot. I don't know what you're weak to. Let's see if I can get a lucky dream needle sleep. Actually, this will probably shock you. It did not, but it did damage. Okay, hit Joker. That did a lot. We're definitely gonna have to heal. I would rather Joker heal himself. Oh, that almost killed. Oh, baby. Just don't let Joker go down. What heals the most? He's probably weak to something. I just don't know what. I didn't buy, like, any normal healing items. That's not good, brother. Maybe I should have just guarded with Joker, actually. Oh, that's not good. Of course that inflicted Dizzy at the worst time imaginable. Can you just, like, crit and kill him, please? Oh, no. Hit him anyways, even though you're confused. Why did you throw something away? Don't, don't hit. He used a multi-hit. Of course he used a multi-hit. Why wouldn't he? Why wouldn't he use a multi-hit? That was so unlucky. If he just didn't get the status effect there, we won. So this is a mini boss though, so it probably just lets me retry or load the last save room. Yeah, we can just restart the battle. All right, we got nothing to worry about. I'll win. We can totally win this. I played slightly too safe. Let's go. I should have just hit him more with Joker. Do I even bother with Secunda? I think I might just go straight for hopefully getting some lucky sleeps and getting more damage. Oh, I got a lucky dodge anyway. All right. We should have this in the bag. Assuming he doesn't... Oh, come on. Assuming he doesn't status affect us again. Can you not? Game? Hello? I would like to hit my attacks, please. Thank you. Game tried to RNG me out of the second attempt, too. <sighs> I thought this was voice. Whew, things are real tough when it's just me and you. It'd be a pain if we got spotted again. Anyway, let's turn off that security system. Takamaki-san, this is bad. Are these the lights? <gasps> what the... Isn't this Sayuri? Why are there so many of them? I have no idea. Get out! Sensei, what is the meaning of this? I suppose I can't keep quiet now that you've seen this. Truth be told, I'm in severe debt. I handmade these Sayuri copies and have been selling them through a special connection of mine. But why? The real Sayuri was stolen by one of my pupils long ago. I assume they begrudged my strictness. That moment was quite a shock for me. Since then, I've been mired in a terrible artist block. Because of this distress, some of my pupils handed their ideas over to me from time to time. Ah. <sighs> I knew I couldn't keep that up, so I attempted to recreate the Sayuri a number of times. However, it resulted in nothing more than replicas. That's when someone came to buy the paintings, knowing, well, they weren't original. It's all my fault. I couldn't pay the price of being famous. As expectations for me rose, it reached a point where I had no choice but to keep making them. I needed money to further your talents. I ask that you please forgive your cowardly teacher. Please, don't. Hold on, something doesn't add up. If the original painting got stolen, how did you make copies of it? I happened to find a finely detailed photograph of it in an art book. So you managed to sell copies of a photo of the original? I'm not sure how this works, but don't people who buy paintings generally have a keen eye for the fine arts? Mm, this sounds like a lie to me. What would you know? Something just doesn't feel right. 
Lady on. This one seems different. Sayori? This... This is the real Sayori. But you just said a moment ago that it was stolen. That is also a copy? That's a replica. No, it's nothing of the sort. This painting kept me going. It's the reason I made it this far. Sensei, don't tell me. It's fake. Yes, a counterfeit. I heard there was a counterfeit spreading around, so I bought it. So you're telling me the actual artist behind the painting bought a counterfeit? That's pushing it. You're lying, Sensei. Please, just tell us the truth. You too? I've reported you to my private security company. Which I speak to on this old flip phone. What? I had it set up to deal with some problematic paparazzi, but I never thought it'd come in so handy. Please, wait. Let's talk about this. You can talk all you want to the police. That includes you, Yusuke. Lady on, let's run! A cat! Where did it... The cat! There's no point. They'll be here within two minutes. Well, it's a good thing we can magically teleport to different locations. Takamaki-san, 